menu bar so let's uh, recap all these uh, concepts but we have uh, done in the previous lecture so far quickly so first of all those who are the new to this website designing they have to first take the domain name so they can go directly to the godaddy.com website and uh, there they need to create their account it is very simple step you can log in with your google account and uh, hardly take five minutes to create your account after creating your account you have to search for your domain basically you can take your domain as your name.com or something your company.com so I have decided to take my domain as my company name as atschool.in. So it's up to you. You can take .com domain, .in domain or whatever you want to take. So take it. And uh, after taking the domain, you have to open that domain. So let's suppose that this is my domain atschool.in. Then you have to open this domain and you have to manage your domain okay so when you click on this manage domain then you will find this type of window right here and uh, here again you will find this manage dns so when you click on this uh, manage dns so you will find your domain name right here so you have to provide these name servers which you will get on your email id while uh, registering to reseller club web hosting so i have told you that you have to log in with this reseller club account and uh, you have to take the web hosting generally there are different uh, type of uh, web hosting but i have used shared hosting because it is uh, somewhat less in price and uh, i am using uh, multiple websites uh, license right here as a pro member so i have selected this plan it's up to you okay uh, whichever plan you prefer you can take it from here so you can check uh, what is the rate for these uh, plans and uh, accordingly you can select this and uh, you will see right here free SSL is available with everyone but right here this space uh, as well as the domains so if you buy single hosting and a single website then this single domain you can host but uh, if you take the pro version then 10 domain up to 10 domain you can uh, register with that uh, hosting okay so i prefer use this one and uh, after using this when you want to create uh, multiple type of website then you can use this uh, multiple shared hosting so uh, when you purchase this you will receive an email uh, and uh, this email look like this and uh, they show you their name server right here you have to copy the, uh, these name servers and uh, you have to paste these name servers in godaddy account right here so you have to place these servers right here and uh, then press uh, ok and uh, then your uh, domain name and your web hosting is integrated with each other so this part we have done in the last lecture after this what you have to do uh, you have to open the reseller club account and uh, open the web hosting and uh, then you have to install the softeculous uh, app installer software or application over there and uh, after installing that uh, you have to use 
the WordPress uh, for installation on this website. So I already installed this in the previous lectures and uh, after installing, uh, you will open that WordPress and uh, it will look like this. So after uh, opening the WordPress, uh, you will see right here when you click, uh, when you over your mouse uh, over this my blog, uh, you will see your visit, uh, your site will be available right here you can right click on it and you can open the site and you can see how your site will look like so in the previous lecture we have designed this uh, menu bar i will uh, this home page right here so firstly you have to click on the settings uh, you will find on the bottom left hand side the setting option is available so click on this setting option and uh, then you scroll this bar and uh, go to the bottom and you will find the page layout option so initially this page layout option is given as default and uh, we have to select this as a Elementor canvas so click on this and uh, update it so you will see this template is fully canvas type okay so now you have to click on this green and veto single and uh, you have to use this template okay you have to use this template i already given you the link so you have to use this template right here so click on this green symbol and uh, you will see all the styles okay of this particular website will be appearing right here okay so I assumed that you have completed till this step on the home page and uh, insert this home page template okay so click on this home page So it is installing and uh, updating. Now you will see this template is installed, but uh, color with uh, color is not proper. So we will arrange these colors and uh, these styles. I have to click on this plus sign. Then again, you have to click on this envato and element and uh, click on this install kit and right here you will see the menu and uh, here you need to select this header so you have to insert this template toward the header side now you can see this header is placed right here and template is already created what you have to do you have to click on the style then you have to click on the backgrounds right here you can see the background it did the header and uh, we have created the pages we have inserted the templates of these headers and the home page uh, what we have to do we have to change these colors so we will 
change these colors in the next lecture so meanwhile you do practice and uh, complete this task and in the next lecture we will complete the coloring of home page and uh, all other menus <laughs>